The Cigarette Litter Prevention Programme has four main strategies. The first one is to review and support local litter ordinances. The second one is to mount a public education campaign where you really raise awareness about the issue of litter, that cigarette butts are litter and they really have no place in the environment. The third strategy is to install ash receptacles at key transition points, that is where people must stop smoking before proceeding and that's where they need to do something with that cigarette butt or cigar tip. And the fourth strategy is the little pocket ashtray from Keep America Beautiful. We distribute thousands of these every year. Thanks to the support of our funders, we have a very robust grant program uh, and our affiliates, they apply for these grants. I, I think we're seeing a change. You know, the few years that I've been working on this program, I'm very encouraged by what we're seeing. Anna Maria Island is, is a unique community. It's real and it's historic, and we have fought for many years to try to keep it that way. This is paradise. Um, no other way to describe it. It's beautiful, the sea life, the bird life, the beaches. When we get popular, like we are getting, with that brings trash, and that brings litter. It was observed by county commissioners in Sarasota County and in Manatee County that there were an enormous amount of cigarette butt on our beaches. And talking to people on the beach, they didn't realize that it was considered litter, number one, and or some of the environmental damages that it causes. And secondly, we realized we really didn't have any sort of bin or place for them to dispose of their cigarettes. What we did is that we initially applied for a grant with Keep America Beautiful. We received 55 cigarette bins and also pocket ashtrays that we did a campaign on the beach to educate all the beachgoers. Um, within a month's time, we noticed a 50% decrease in our cigarette litter, and also the, the cigar tips as well. And that's where we saw the reduction the most in those two areas. Yeah, the, the prevention program is about educating the general public of what's going on. Not only the residents, uh, but the visitors that we have come to our community and that, you know, this is our home too. In 2011, we were named by Parent Magazine as one of the top 10 family beaches in America. You do not see the butts all over the place anymore. People are picking their butts up and they're putting them in the dispensers that have been provided through Keep Manatee Beautiful, which has been a tremendous success. We, um, we are definitely looking forward to seeing a continuation of the kind of program successes that we've achieved to date. We have so many beautiful, gorgeous landscapes in this country and it's so important that we maintain the resources for generations to come. So certainly when we're out and about, when we're enjoying the environment and the wonders that it has to provide us, the only thing we should be leaving behind is our footprints.